G'day everyone, Matt from Instinct Health here and I just wanted to go through a few tips now that it's getting colder and we are finding exercise harder and harder, particularly if you've got a case of the sniffles as well. So I just wanted to give you three really quick tips about how you can keep in some good habits and some good exercise routines over these colder months. So number one is in fact that keep a routine. If you're an alarm person and your alarm goes off every morning, make sure as the winter months set in, you don't become a snooze person. So if the alarm goes off, stick to your routine and get out of bed straight away. Likewise, if you wanna flip your routine around, you wanna to go to the gym or you wanna go for a run after work, put your clothes in your bag, make sure you do it before you go home rather than sitting down on the couch because you'll never get back up again. Number two is find some fun. There are a lot of cool activities that you can do, no pun intended, in these colder months. So try ice skating, go into a hot sauna or a hot spa um, and try something a little bit different and that way you can stay in some sort of a routine even if it's not your regular routine. And number three is listen to the cues of your body. Sometimes if we're running on empty and our body's just screaming at us to say, I need a rest, then that's the best sign that you need to actually take that rest. So if you're feeling like your running's just a little bit slower, a little bit harder, and you can't keep up with some of the times that you're normally doing or the weights that you're normally lifting in the gym, listen to your body, have that good rest, um, reset for 24, 48 hours, and then go again. So um, those are my three tips for exercising when it's a little bit colder and maybe you're feeling a little bit under weather. So try them throughout this winter and then hopefully come spring and summertime, you'll still be feeling a million bucks.